In this video from Casio Help, we're taking a look at the E037 digital amount limitation over on the SRC range of registers. Uh, for this particular error message, it basically means we've got a problem with the cash button. So if we clear the error message and try and re-enter another transaction or another line of the transaction, we can see that the department buttons are working correctly. But when we try and cash the sale off, we're getting the error message. So there's been some... Either a high amount has been programmed into the cash button correctly, possibly, um, or in most cases it means that the cash button has become misprogrammed. So the only way of dealing with this is to reset the cash button. So first of all, you need to clear the error message by pressing C and then press either cash the sale off if it's correct using a different tender button or cancel it. So I'm just going to show you how to cancel it. So it's subtotal, error correct cancel, and then CA amount 10 to confirm the cancellation. So no transaction has been processed. So now we need to go and fix the cash button. So to do that, key to PGM and then arrow down to program or sorry, system setting, CA amount 10 to enter, and then free subtotal zero CA amount 10 subtotal. Now the code will be different if you've got special programming on the cash button. So if you've set the button up, if your machine prints the tax split um, on the till receipts, then you will need to enter a different code instead of the uh, zero cash amount 10. What I've done there is reset the button back to factory default so that it'll definitely work. What I'll do is I'll put up a video showing you how to force the tax splits um, to appear on the receipt and that'll give you the code um, to use to set the button up. I think it's one double zero triple zero and then the cash button but check out my other video first before you do that. Okay so key back to reg and then now when we process the transaction can't remember exactly what it was but it was something along the lines of this we should now see that when, because the cash button's been reprogrammed and reset when we cash the sale off we don't get the error message get the receipt print out if we've got it if we've got the post receipt button set up okay yeah so that video will be appearing now showing you how to force the tax splits on your till receipts it's nothing to worry about if you don't normally have the till receipts on there uh, the tax split on your receipts but it's just crucial what i've told you to do won't help you out um, but yeah you can also subscribe to this youtube channel or visit casiohelp.co.uk for more thanks for watching